And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is action from Liga Uber Eats. It's Bordeaux up against Nantes. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, his recent form speaks for itself. Three goals in the last three games, and he's playing with great confidence at the moment. Every chance he could add to that tally today. This is how Bordeaux will line up. Well, when they don't have possession, it will be a back five. But when they win the ball back, the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3 5 2. The starting lineup then for Nantes. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And the game begins. Gregerson Otavio Ellis Adley showing a must score oh and couldn't convert Chirivea Kolo Muani well, The attack looks promising Girotto Options in the middle Not Showing good patience Superb block Mensa. An alert intervention. Girotto. Pedro Tirivea. Interception to snuff out the danger. Albert Ellis and that's an important intervention moving the ball forward with purpose can he play it in it might be on for them perfect tackle a really effective shielding under pressure And a throw-in forthcoming. Yasin Adli. Huang Ui Jo. Albert Ellis. Well, he's beaten his man comprehensively. 
And he read it really well. Fine save. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? He's driven in the corner. Well, a harmless effort when all is said and done. Sebastian Korcha. Well, as you can see, it's been really tight and neither side has taken enough risk going forward. Hopefully that will change soon and then we might get some entertainment. There's a slide draw pass. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Well, if only he had timed his run slightly better. Offside. Stian Rode Gregerson. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Ottavio. Will he finish? Oh, it's gone in! A derby goal, the first of the contest. Electric. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Kono Muani. An authoritative challenge. And with that, the first half draws to a close. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I'm sure the manager will be delighted with him. He'll have drilled it into them to keep their focus, keep playing through to the half-time whistle, and it's certainly put them in a good position to go on and win this now. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Blas. Girotto. And teammates to play it to. Can they get in behind them? Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Ottavio. It's with Huang Uijo. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Well, not allowed to continue. He had drifted into the offside position. Well, if he takes a step back to the ball and then spins in behind, he'll be onside. But he does know where the space is. Time for a change then. Uh, 
Shielding the ball superbly. Chance to play it in. Efficient play to hold on to the ball and wait for teammates to get there. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Yassine Adli. And there to intervene. Moving it forward. And that always looked likely to run through to the keeper. Could be a chance to break here. Can they take advantage of the situation? Oh, brilliant goalkeeping! So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. So the corner played into the box. No nonsense clearance. And possibilities here. Can he put it away? An unforced error, you've got to say. Yassine Adli. Still passing it around with authority. Adley. Adley has it. He could pick out a teammate. Yassine Adley. Otavio has it. Adley. Well, let's see about the... Not really the ideal clearance. On the attack, is there to be late drama? Traore. Well, it's one pass after another. Could play it in. However, nothing comes of it. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Inside the final five minutes now. Ellis. I must say, this looks promising. Mensa. Yassine Adli. He has time to play it over. Juan Uijo. Fran Sergio. Ellis. Otavio has it. And now Coco. And there's the whistle. They cannot be separated after 90 minutes.